Today we have a special show. I'll be unboxing my 2500 Jordan for my personal collection. So let's get on with the show. We're going to celebrate together. Just this. This gives you a little box action. I hope it focuses for you guys. All right. This shoe is the Jordan Proto Max 720 metallic silver gem red and black aka the jordan 720 johnny kilroy's i don't know why i gotta say it like that i'm gonna go take out one of these is this a stock x buy or is this a nike buy i believe this is a nike buy guys so. Yeah, this, this is most likely a Nike buy. I think they had them on sale. Let me just uh, move you back a bit. There we go, guys. So you guys get full good view. This front view is made of some type of fabric. If you saw the Jordan Proto Max 720 before. Yeah, let's adjust the camera real quick. There we go, guys. The Jordan Proto Max 720. Get the spin on for you guys. Johnny Kilroy edition. Has a high back, jump man strap, 720 uh, bottom. Nice construction, it's just a good shoe. We just completed my Jordan Proto Max 720 collection. So it's steady. I think I'm only missing one. Move this back. Don't burn my dad's house down while he's at work. But again, this is the Jordan 720 Proto Max Johnny Kilroy. That's a pretty decent bottom. Best feature of this shoe is it last a long time. All right, guys, let's get to the next shoe. All right, guys, this is the next shoe. Let me get you some box action. This is not a special shoe, I believe. This is just the Air Jordan 1 Mid. Black, pine green, white, and gem red. Pick these up on a shopping trip for my friend G. So we were having a Nike sale at the outlet. I went with him to pick up a couple pairs. This is one of the pairs I purchased. But now we are on the 2500 Jordan. It should be 2,501 right here. And no special order, just as I take them out the boxes. But it's still a celebration, so pop your bottles, spark up your blunts, joints, and enjoy the show. Jordan, this is poor man's if you missed. The pine green twos with the Jordan uh, one retro. Eyes. This is your shoe. It's a pretty good shoe. Most people say they don't like Jordan mids. I, I like Jordan mids. I don't really have a problem with them. I, I like Jordan mids better than I like Jordan lows, but that's not what this video is about. So let's get on to the next shoe. Well, let me show you guys the bottom of this one, even though everybody should know the bottom of a Jordan 1. All right, guys, we're going to the next shoe. All right, the next shoe. Get you some box action, guys. The next shoe is the Jordan Mars Black Ant and Gem Red, aka the Patent Leather Bread 270. This is a pretty good shoe. This is about maybe my second favorite Jordan 270. And this is my second favorite Jordan 270. Not really a big fan of patent leather sneakers, but I just had to have these because they were in the bread colorway. I love any Jordan that's in the bread colorway. I have to add it to the collection. I'm an OG colorway guy who isn't a fan of the breads. 
Again, this is the Jordan Mars 270 bread patent leather edition. All right, guys, let's get to the next shoe. All right, guys, this next shoe is a StockX purchase. Bust her open. Ready to bring it out. StockX has new bubble wrap. They put in with the shoes. Got uh, some box action. <coughs> this is, like I said, from StockX. You guys can see where I got in at. Get your little StockX. Sticker, you guys know how the deal goes. Pretty much upset with StockX right now. StockX, you guys gotta get it together. Your deliveries are slow. Shoes are coming damaged. These look like they didn't come too damaged, but we're checking them out together, guys. Turn the tags so you can get the full experience. This shoe is, of course, you see it already, but it's the Air Jordan 5 Retro Top 3. Edition, they call this shoe. Just one of my favorite Jordan 5s. I got a few pair. This is going to be my wearing pair. Probably put a little bit of wear and tear and beat these up. Even though I really can't because I have we'll put ozone treatment on them. Stock X let a couple of lenties get through, but it's okay. This shoe is just outstanding in my opinion. I'm going to switch out the laces though. Never like the laces that come with the with these Jordans recently. They're uh that's not good. Like I believe that this shoe would have stood out with a, another pair of laces, maybe purple, red. I'm gonna put in either or. It got a little bit of bottom action. I wanted this to be my twenty fifth hundred Jordan, but. I got all the sneakers out of the box. It's different, but we're still celebrating. Like I said, yay. The Jordan Top 3s are now in my collection for wearing and staring. I love that Nike Air on the back. The whole silhouette of this shoe is just outstanding. Got to have a pair of these. All right, guys. We're going to get on to the next Jordan. All right, the next pair. Let's get you guys some of that box action. This is the Air Jordan 1 Retro Mid SE. I don't think this is a retro, so we're just going to call it the Air Jordan 1 Mid SE. It's black, team orange, and umbrella. Everybody who saw the same SE 270s in one of my other videos will remember this colorway. Get it out of the box. It isn't a bad Jordan. If you get that good outfit, <clears throat> pardon me guys, you could you could wear this Jordan. It's not bad at all. People say they don't like the colorway. They're sitting in some states. Some states they sold out where I got them. They were sitting. So that's why I got them. They were on sale and sitting. So I got a pair. I knew that these were going to not sell out everywhere. So after I got the initial pairs that I got and sold, I just waited because I know they were going to drop. Check out the bottom. It's like a lot of places people don't like Jordan 1 mids, but like I said, I like Jordan 1 mids. They're becoming more popular with other people. I just don't like Jordan 1 Lowe's, even though I own an uh, ungodly amount of Jordan 1 Lowe's. I like any low sneakers, and I own an ungodly amount of low sneakers, but just because I have to. Give you guys a little bit more back action. Alright guys, this is the final shoe. Remember to comment, like, and subscribe. Let me know any shoes you want to see on the up and coming show. The past 2,500 Jordans now. Make sure that you stay tuned so you can see the next 2,500 Jordans we're going to go through. I'll probably have another two or 300 pairs of Jordans to go through. I got to go through about 
30 plus pairs of Air Maxes again. So we're starting the Air Max collection. Uh, I got some Yeezys to go through for you guys. Some I uh, got some PEs to go for you guys because I know you guys love seeing PEs on other people's channels. So I'm going to bring them here. Let me know, like I said, what you guys want to see on the channel. Continuing, make sure you celebrate and tell everybody that you saw someone open their 2500 Jordan. Like I said, we're going to keep pushing the show forward. As long as you guys keep tuning in, we're going to keep making. Thanks, guys. Everybody fucking jump!